Hi folks, this is all the fruit and here I have the choke cherry, Prunus virginiana from Eastern North America. This is not a cherry you usually find in Germany. We have a few other North American species. We have the pretty similar Prunus serotina from North America, which is naturalized in large parts of Germany. But this Prunus virginiana grows in the Heidelberg Botanic Garden. And like Prunus serotina and Prunus padus, which is native to Germany, it is in the subgenus Padus, where the cherries grow in racemes, like not one cherry, not one by one, but in big yeah, clumps <laughs> or clusters or hanging inflorescences called racemes. So I don't know if those are completely ripe. I think I remember a video, maybe it was by the Weird Fruit Explorer where it is actually a little bit darker but well I guess they should be ripe enough to enjoy them so let's try them hmm quite astringent The taste really reminds me of hmm, Eliagnus. Yeah. And some of the juicy Eliagnus species have a similar, um, similar taste. Only when they are fully ripe, this taste kind of diminishes. I wonder if it's the same with the choke cherries, if you have to wait till they are completely ripe. They are fully edible right now, well, at least taste-wise. I don't know how many you can eat without getting in trouble. There are some cherries which are slightly poisonous, but taste-wise they are okay. Just, I'm someone who likes really ripe fruit, so probably I would wait a week or two before I stuff my face with handfuls of those. Well, I wouldn't do this anyway because we're in the botanic garden, so I just use a couple fruit for the videos and I don't pick huge amounts. So folks, since I'm not sure how much of this uh, Prunus virginiana you can eat without any harm, better Google it thoroughly before you want to eat a pound or two of it. I'm sure it's okay in small amounts, but I cannot tell you if you can eat it just like the normal Prunus avium in huge amounts. Okay, folks, this was Prunus virginiana from the eastern United States. Stay tuned for a lot more fruit videos from the parks and gardens of Germany. And don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe.